Happy Vlogmas Day 20, I think, or 21, depending on if my get ready with me gets approved. I'm currently making myself coffee in the kitchen, and then I need to come in here and get this brand deal filmed that I need to send in before I do, like, anything today. So, yeah, it's such a nice day out today. I finally woke up in, like, a really good mood. I've been waking up in very weird moods lately. I got my period, like, two days ago, so I've just been waking up, like in a fog and just like not feeling like myself and i was just having like very anxious days and now i finally feel just like good so i'm happy got my coffee here's the mug of the day even when i make iced coffee i've been putting it in mugs just because i have the cutest christmas mugs this one's the new york holiday anthro mug so pretty i love it so good i'm gonna add cinnamon to it amazing i also have this from trader joe's turmeric juice shot i want to take so today i just have honestly just a lot of like editing stuff to do and brand deals to send in but i need it to be done with all work related things i don't know what time at but i need to leave here at four because we are going on a date tonight i'll talk more about the details i guess and like what we're doing later but it is a third date so We'll see. I feel like a third date is like make or break it. Like, I don't know. We'll talk about the date later, but I need to leave here at like four to go head over there. So I need to get all my work done before that. So yeah, but it's going to be a good day. It's beautiful out. I woke up in a good mood. So, you know, things are looking good. I'm going to throw on some eye patches because... I look like I didn't sleep 10 hours last night, but I did. I slept 10 hours last night, and I still wake up with the darkest under eyes. It's just genetic, but these do help a little bit. Perf. Okay, I just ate a little something really quick. Now I'm going to do a little bit of makeup. I want to get, like, actually ready tonight for this date, so I'm not going to do the most. I'm just going to do a little bit of concealer. Make myself just, like, look a little alive for this tiktok that i need to film it's like a hair tiktok so as long as my hair looks good that's really all that matters but obviously i don't want to look like shit <laughs> so i'm gonna do a little like makeup and hopefully bang out this video quick it's for kristen s and i need to straighten my hair in it so at least my hair will be done early for my date tonight <laughs> i've been trying to figure out when i should go home for christmas i'm going home this week my mom's gonna pick me up but i'm also waiting on a couple of gifts to come in so i need to wait till all my gifts are here to leave and go home i'm so excited to be going home for christmas though because i always just go home for like one night at a time since i live so close and i have the cats here you know holy shit i just had a very intense sneeze attack mid conversation but as i was saying actually i don't even think it's done hold on <coughs> guys i can't sneeze without sneezing a thousand times and it really hurts anyways as i was saying i always just go home for one night at a time since i live close but i'm going home for christmas for a full week and i'm bringing the cats with me so i'm so excited to be able to just like be with my family non-stop for a week and just chill and have that like good quality time you know it's just hard with the cats like i would honestly do it more often and stay for longer periods of times but my cats don't love going there they don't love the change of scenery too much especially boo so i try to only bring them there when it's like necessary like christmas or something but yeah i'm so excited i was originally gonna go tomorrow actually but i think i'm gonna wait until friday because i have packages i'm waiting for so that's that i'm gonna finish doing my makeup really quick and then we're gonna get this thing filmed <laughs> Okay, I just finished filming and editing that reel, sent it in, so that's done. And I just realized I need to go move my car right now because it's street sweeping day. I parked on the street last night because I found a spot like right in front of my apartment. 
and I was bringing stuff in from Target, so I parked on the street, and I need to move, or I'm gonna get a ticket. So, I'm gonna go do that super quick, and then I need to edit. I'm so tired, I just felt like I just ran into a wall head first, so that's great, love that. But yeah, we're just gonna do this super quick. Maybe it'll be good for me and get outside for a second before I start editing. I'm like really not in the mood to go on a date tonight, just because I feel like I have so much to do, but it's fine. I wanna go, like, I'm just... Mm, you know, like I just have been such a homebody and I've just been like wanting to ghost everybody Which is like it literally says nothing about the people and just everything about me because the only reason I really ever ghost people is because I just feel like isolating myself. It's like an issue that I do But anyway, I don't know like okay I turned on the camera to tell you guys I was going to move my car I'm not sure why I'm telling you that I'm isolating myself and trying to not do that anymore. I this is why I need to get a therapist, okay. I just went and moved my car really quick. It is freezing out today. Like, oh my God, I thought it was gonna be kind of warm because it just like looks beautiful out, but no, freezing. So I'm editing today's video. Frankie wants to cuddle. She's being super sweet today. No, having a cat, like if you don't have a cat, you need one because like, this is just all the serotonin that I've ever needed. I love you. She's being so sweet, but yeah, I'm gonna bang out this video really quick right now. This is as Frankie cuddles me. This is this is the highlight of my day. You cannot tell me that this isn't the most perfect thing you've ever seen. Are you putting out a show? She has been like just laying next to me this whole time. The second I pull out the camera, she hops on me, starts purring, starts being all sweet and so beautiful and cute. She just wants to be the star of the show. Have your moment, girl. There you go. She loves it. She loves the camera. Guys, okay, I turned off the camera and she hopped off of me. Oh, 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 nope. Now the camera's back on and she's back on top of me. I'm telling you, she's being an attention hoe. She literally just wants to be the star of the vlog right now. You putting on a show, you're literally putting on a show for the people. I just caught you, red-handed. Literally turned off the camera, put it down. She hopped right off of me. Now look at her. Now the camera's back on, being all sweet. Mm-hmm. She's unreal, wow. I just finished editing my video for today. I'm so happy it's uploading right now. I just need to make the thumbnail really quick and then get it all posted. I feel great. It's only two o'clock right now and I don't need to leave my apartment until 4.59. So we're doing very, very good on time. I have never edited, actually I have because I've done Vlogmas before, but like the amount of editing and looking at your own face during Vlogmas is really wild. I have seen way too much of myself this month. It's getting very out of hand. Now it's time to get ready. I just washed my face because I had a little bit of makeup on from when I filmed earlier. I just wanted to start from scratch. Also, I made another coffee because I'm tired. <laughs> They're street sweeping outside of my apartment, so give me a second. I don't feel like talking over this loud ass truck. Okay, I think that the street sweeping is done, but they're also doing loud construction in the street over, so just ignore any background noises. I don't even know if the camera could really pick it up, but it is bothering me. Anyways, so I'm going on a third date. Don't freak out. <laughs> don't freak out, you guys, because it's, it's fine. So this is obviously with the guy that I posted about going on a second date with, and you guys keep asking me about him, like, keep being like, oh, how's the guy that you went on a second date with, blah, blah, blah. So, I don't know. I don't know how he is, because I haven't seen him in quite some time. I'm kind of, I'm, like, excited to see him, and I'm excited to go on this date, but I'm also nervous, because I haven't seen him in so long. Like, I think it's literally been, like, maybe over a month since our last date. I feel like three dates is a really good amount of dates to be able to see if a situation is gonna go anywhere but this also literally feels like another first date because i i kind of forget like everything we talked about for the most part like it's been so long i feel like i've lived like nine lives since our last date but it shall be fun we're going to bryant park i've been to bryant park literally twice during vlogmas but he hasn't been yet and he's been wanting to go so we're gonna go and do that for a bit and then we're gonna get dinner someplace near it i don't know where we're getting dinner yet i don't think that we decided on a place unless he has something in mind but yeah and maybe we also will go see the tree <laughs> We actually have not discussed that, but I really want to see the tree. I haven't seen the tree yet. This year, is the tree on this mug of New York? No. That's weird that Anthro didn't put the Rockefeller tree on this Christmas themed New York cup. Anyways, I haven't seen 
the Rockefeller tree this year. That's like a very couple-y thing to do though. Like I've only ever gone to see the tree with like friends or my ex. So I don't really know if going to see the Rockefeller tree is like a third date idea, but I want to see it and we're going to be right by it. So maybe we'll see if I'm feeling the vibes of wanting to ask to do that. I don't know, but I'm going to have to bundle the fuck up. That's all I know because Brian Park's outside, obviously, and it's freezing and it's only gonna get colder because the sun's gonna go down. So I need to bundle the fuck up and hopefully it's a good date. I'm excited, but I'm nervous. I'm also going to try to vlog on the date. Not, I'm probably not gonna talk to the camera, but I'm gonna try to get like clips of whatever we're doing because I wanna bring you guys along the date. I think that'll be fun, but there's no way in hell I'm gonna start talking to a camera on a date. No way. So I'll probably just use my phone and get some clips of this little date. Okay, I'm all ready. I did my makeup and I went over my hair a little bit more. The straightener. I need to pick out an outfit. I am literally so tired. <laughs> it's getting dark out. It's like four something. Okay. 4.39. I need to leave here by 4.59 if I want to walk to the path. So you. I need to hurry up because I don't know what to wear. I just like, I don't feel like getting dressed for the cold weather. I'm gonna wear leggings with pants over them because I don't want to freeze. We're gonna do some leggings with these white fox jeans, I think. And then I think I'm gonna do this red long sleeve as like my layering shirt. Where is the sweater? I'm so confused because I can't find the sweater that I want to wear. And I haven't worn it since when I was in London. I don't know where it could be because I know I haven't worn it. No, I lost my sweater. It has to be like right in front of my face, I feel like. I am so confused. Of course, the one shirt that I like have in mind for this outfit, nowhere to be found. I found it. <laughs> for real. I actually can't. Okay, it's this sweater. <sighs> Thank God. I'm gonna try this on and see how it looks and I'll be right back. Okay, it's 4.56 and I realize that right now, actually right as I turn this camera on, that I need to leave in a few minutes. But I'm dressed and I actually think this outfit came out cute, but I probably am gonna be cold a little bit, but it's okay. This is what we're working with. I think it's cute. The leather jacket is probably not doing much for me at all, but I have on two layers underneath it and I also brought gloves with me and I have on leggings and then jeans and two pairs of socks. So hopefully I'm fine. I don't know, I think it looks cute. Okay, I just decided to call an Uber to take me to the path station because I don't feel like walking right now there. And I also just decided that I should take a shot of tequila before I go. Bad idea, maybe. Necessary, definitely. Sometimes a shot of tequila is necessary to eliminate nerves and help build confidence. Okay? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna hurry up, my Uber is like three minutes away. I wanted to drink a glass of wine, but I just don't have time and then I'll have to pee because that's way too much liquid. Wait, I'm like so, I'm like scared. I don't like dates. Like I know it'll be fine, but I'm like just not in the mood to talk right now, which is like the whole point of a date. Cheers. Ew. That was actually vile. Oh. Why'd I do that? Why'd I do that to myself? That was what I like to call a confidence shot. Thank you. Okay. Really embarrassed that I'm going on this date with my scissor nails. Unbelievable. All right, let's go. <laughs> the city. I'm walking over to Bryant Park now. Wish me luck. Hey girls, I'm in the bathroom. Fixing my lips. This is Drew's lip liner that I realized she left in my bag. And I'm loving the color. I'm gonna give it back to her. She doesn't even know I have it. I need to tell her. It's in the shade Super Size Me. So pretty by Charlotte Tilbury. I've had one glass of wine. <laughs> and why am I tipsy? But I'm having a good time. We're at this little like hotel restaurant. Every place was like booked up and busy. We only stayed at Bryant Park for a little bit, but this place actually got, I got mac and cheese for dinner. 
really good. Really good stuff, guys. I loved it. I don't even know the name of this place. Oh god, this looks awful. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Hold on. But yeah, this is fun. Um, he's probably gonna watch this, I feel like. So if you're watching this, hey, this is what I was doing in the bathroom. Is this Marilyn Monroe? This bathroom's iconic, honestly. Look at how cute it is. Okay, bye. Love you guys. So I tried to take the subway down to where I get on the path and the downtown train said it was going uptown. Like I got on and it said that the next stop was uptown. So I got off. It was like next stop 169th street. I'm like, bro. So waiting for an Uber to go downtown to where I need to get on the path because I got confused and I'm not trying to get lost. So I'd rather just do this. But if I Uber all the way home, it's going to be too expensive for my sanity. So that's that. Anyway, this has been fun. Got to see the tree. That was a sleigh. Okay, I'm back home right now. My commute home literally took like an over an hour because the train, I don't even, the subway confused me. I was so confused because I went on the downtown one. Like I'm, I was correct. It said downtown F&M. But then I got on and it was like next stop 169th street. So I got so scared because I was like, there's no way that I'm going all the way. Like if I went all the way up to 169th street, that would have just been, oh my God. And that would have been so upset. That's so far from me. So I, I got right off. I saw that and I was like, I'm not even taking the chance of getting stuck on this train for that long. And then I decided to walk home at 10 30 PM in the cold and whatever. I made it. That's all that really matters is that I'm fucking home and it took a trek to get here, but I'm really happy to be here and I'm tired. I'm going to take my makeup off and I'm going to go to sleep. I had a really nice night and that's all I'm going to say. I'm trying to keep my dating life like private, but I also like overshare like a motherfucker online. So I'm trying to find like a nice little balance. Like I feel like this is fun. Got to bring you guys on a cute little date. It was very sweet. Like saw the tree, went to Bryant Park, got a nice little dinner. It was a good time. And now I'm gonna take my makeup off, go to sleep, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for yet another day of Vlogmas. Yep. And this video is actually going up on the 21st because my haul got approved for tomorrow. So that's a sleigh. So yeah, I can't believe that we only have like four more days left of this. It's crazy. But I love you guys so much. This has been a grand old time and I will see you guys tomorrow.